Okay, is it working now? Oh I'm god. Just telling your sister. I hope it's working because now I'm playing been looking it. looking to make a match for me. And Talia has been such good company. Think she likes me? Or maybe your mother. A flower plot is still a flower. Just dies more quickly. We could be a family, Lord Forrester. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Your mother may need some convincing. She seems like the type to hold a grudge. She'll never marry either of them. Never such an awfully long time. But let's put our happy day to the side for a moment. Walk with me. Oh. You won't need your sword. Not where we're going. Very well. That was easy. There. Doesn't that feel better? Oh. You're coming too. This is Lord's business, not a child's. I say she comes. I don't trust her with my men. Oh, man. I, okay. Oh, man. I don't know if I'm gonna regret not bringing the sword. I swear to God, if he touches her. <sighs> How fares your father, Lord Bolton? Better than yours. <laughs> Polite of you to ask. I loved playing in the woods when I was your age. Still do. So many places to hide. I've gotten very good at finding people. Roderick? It's all right, Talia. That reminds me. Where's Griff? I expected to be greeted by him on my arrival. Bit of a disappointment to have to show myself in. And here I had such high hopes, lads. Griff and his men are under guard. They have no place here. They do if I say they do. Oh, I really hoped things might be different with you. I hoped we could be friends. After all, I was generous. I've allowed you to keep half your forest. Your livelihood. Yet you went behind my back. And called in the Glenmores. Yeah, see, I didn't want to. I'm not sure how you managed that. The Glenmores have sworn their loyalty to my father. The Glenmores came to us. We never asked for their help. Oh? Perhaps I need to have a word with Lord Glenmore. Well, I'm certainly glad we've sorted this out. Thank you for being so forthcoming. You're welcome. But there's still a price. Ah. Here we are. Oh my god. You disobeyed me. Oh. Someone has to pay. Listen. Don't. You didn't think it would be you, did you? Your damaged goods. Someone else's laptop. Arthur's done nothing wrong! If you want to hurt someone, hurt me! No, Roderick! Why bother? You're nearly a corpse already. No! Oh my god! Stop! Oh no! Look at what you've done! I hope it was worth it. Is it worth it, Arthur? Please stop! Oh my god! Talia, don't look away. It's very important you see what comes of disobedience. Roderick, make him stop! Don't look. Please. Look at him, Talia. No. See what your brother's done. That is not my fault. That is you. Sorry. But they'll never learn otherwise. <laughs> Arthur would be safe at home with his fat father if it weren't for Roderick. This is his fault. That's a lot of blood. You're right. 
This is my fault. I told you, Talia. No. Shoot. All lads fainted. Let's give him a minute. Just <laughs> hurt me, not you him. You want to kill me, don't you? Release him. Not really. I just kind of want to lock you away somewhere. Put you in a straight jacket. That's what I want to do with you. Go on. Prove how strong you are. Do it for Ethan. No, Roderick. No. He's toying Absolutely with you. not. You will not make me hurt you. Your little brother had bigger balls than you. Mm. I came here to kill you. But now I realize it might be far more entertaining to watch Lurt tear you to pieces. I never want to come back to this fucking shit sting of a hold fast. I have better things to do than to play wet nurse to you and Lurt. So you'll settle this on your own. Last house standing, win. Okay. Otherwise I'll kill you both and be done with it. House Forester will win this fight. You're very confident for a man with no army and half a face. And one more thing. <laughs> oh my god. Can't leave a job half finished. <sighs> oh. Ready the horses. Not sure you'll have much luck finding other allies. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh. Good old Game of Thrones. Oh my god. What? Kill him slowly. Nah. No thanks. It's 2.30 a.m. for me. Oh wow. I'm sorry, Chris. I missed the whole episode. I was having fun to chat for me to Simon. Where are you from? Um, at least it was reasonably quick. Because... Yeah, guys. <laughs> sorry, sorry about that. But I'm, I'm really like, I'm gonna be very focused on this episode, and I'm gonna be talking about this episode. So. If you want to talk about this episode with me, if you want to watch and react to what's going on with me, you are more than welcome. So let's experience this together, shall we? that would do such a thing. The Boltons will pay for this. been through must the gods continue to shit on this house what have we ever done to them follow the Starks obey the rule of law Ramsey Snow is a bloody savage he shames the entire north yet we're bound by law to obey him can't believe it's fucking come to this the Glenmore guard are gone Ordered home by Ramsay. So much for having allies. 
Ramsay says he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be yours, Royal. You'll get no argument from me. But how do we bloody fight them? We just don't have the numbers. Not yet, anyway. Hmm. And they still have Ryan. We'll worry about that after we get Ryan back. Once we've made the trade, then we can start to Where is he? Where is my brother? Oh, no. Oh, baby. Oh, honey. Let me through! Oh, no. You, do, you don't want to see him. Tell like me that. where he... No, it isn't. I brought him into this. No, it isn't your fault. I asked him to help. You can't blame yourself, Lena. He was a grown man. He made his own choices. But he trusted me. He always has. Oh, my God. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. He was so nervous that father called him Quiver. And now to die like this, tortured. Ramsay Snow did this. He's a madman. Ramsay was here because of you, Roderick. What if we hadn't been your allies? Elena. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna, Let's I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be held accountable for Ramsey's actions. How do we keep going? You cannot make me feel guilty about that. Where do I find the strength? Know that we'll have our justice someday. Justice won't bring my brother back. You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. Right from the very beginning. I should try to get some sleep. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I don't know what else to do. You're not alone, Elena. I'm here for you, whatever you need. Thank you, Andre. Hashtag poor Chris. <laughs> it's her fault. I don't know this game, but it's her fault. No, it isn't. It isn't. Oh, there you are. I haven't seen you since the coronation feast. Oh. How many ships do you suppose it takes to move an army? Ships? Why in the world would you... Never mind. Mira. I'll be honest. Everybody. Hey. Marjorie saw, of course, and she knew exactly how you got there. I'm sorry about that. I, I really did try to be discreet. But you couldn't, could you? Because you're in over your head. I know it. And Marjorie knows it. Which is why it's not safe for me to be around you anymore. What? what? Mira, you're not the girl I knew at Highgarden. What? She'd never be so reckless. And now that Garibald and I are discussing marriage, I just can't risk being associated with you. Not anymore. Are you no serious? I, this marriage. I won't do anything to jeopardize it. Sarah, you can't mean this. I have too few friends in King's Landing as it is. I'm sorry. I really am. Are you serious? I just can't anymore. <gasps> oh, oh, oh is my it worth gosh. It? Sacrificing so much for your family. The 
They're still in very grave danger, I'm afraid. Well, I know you'll do everything in your power to protect them. Yeah, I will, because they're not going to drop me like a dime. Better go before she sees me. She'll be a forester. What? Can I help you? You need to come with me. Now. Uh, Why okay. would I? Okay. Don't make this difficult. Just, just go with them. He's like whispering. So he... Oh, you know what? He's probably... I'm gonna guess he's bringing me to Cersei. Oh god, no. Scene change. <laughs> Dang it. Come on, Beska, listen. How can you still be angry at me? Is that a joke? Wow, that I girl has the nerve, right? Maybe let him go. You know why. No real friend, yeah, exactly. You were afraid of disobeying the pretty little queen. You chose your prize over my one chance of revenge. Enough! Your revenge would have cost me everything. It'd be Whoa. worth it to see him dead. Oh, and you didn't mean that. that to my family's corpses. <sighs> we should never have come here. This city. It only holds pain for me, Asha. I was hoping to bury it all with Dezor's corpse. But you denied me that. I... Please, I don't want to talk about it again. Honestly, like, back. it's really not the answer to kill somebody. <laughs> it's really not. Our second sons and get out of here. If you did as you were told, Daenerys should deliver. Daenerys, huh? First names with the Queen now, are we? Hey, Mako, what's going on, man? Okay, here we Your go. Grace. My nephew has returned from his mission. It seems you played your part in the taking of Marine, Asher Forrester. Yes, I did. Did you run into any trouble? No. Reports from the battle are muddled. Perhaps you can clear them up. Well? No. My time is short. Nothing out of the ordinary, Your Grace. We fulfilled your orders. To the letter, if reports are true. Yeah. I hear you know how to follow orders, despite your friend's efforts to make you stray. Yeah? You told me Asher was a man of integrity, Malcolm. Now I know you were telling the truth. Aww, yay! You have proved yourself an honorable warrior. Awesome! You have my gratitude. Yes. This moment, I feel good. Unfortunately, I Oh, they're gonna take it away! What? But your grace, the mission was a success. Um, why? I need every soldier to hold Marine. This is why you denied me my revenge? What did I tell you? You promised me Croft and his second sons. Which is why I'm not going to let you leave here empty-handed. Okay. In truth, we are not so different. We're both far from home. We've both suffered the loss of those we've loved. And we both struggle to do what's right. And we're both attractive! <laughs> That's high praise, Your Grace. I'm on it. You've earned it. I cannot give you my cell swords, but I will give you the next best thing. I think in another playthrough I'll, I'll select that option and see what she says. <laughs> this gold will be of use. Perhaps you can find the swords you need in Marine. Thank you, Your Grace. We promise to put it to good use. I'm sure you will. A new day is born in Marine. The slaves mm. have thrown off their collars. There are fighters among those who used to be bound. On behalf of the Foresters and the Branfields, I thank you. All right. See that you are ready when I return to Westeros. I have other plans for you, Malcolm. Plans what? For me, Your Grace. Well, um. Plans that will help House Forrester, I hope. I would like you to stay and serve me. What? I have a task for you. Your Grace, I. Um. I am humbled. But I owe my allegiance to my family. 
Yeah, what are and you... And they will be grateful for the Targaryen alliance you've helped forward. I am honored you would ask me. Might I discuss it with my nephew first? Do so. But let me know your answer soon. Okay, all right. Okay, that's reasonable. She's like the queen. You seriously consider staying in Essos? Oh my I'm god. I'm not sure. This is all rather sudden. If she does come to Westeros, we'd want Daenerys Targaryen on our side. Yeah, but she's not going to. I could strengthen that bond. It's worth thinking about, you have to admit. You'd abandon us with the White Hills at our doors. We need every sword. What's a sword to a dragon? Just think what this alliance might mean for your house. But whatever comes of this, we still need men who will fight for us now. The Queen thought we might find them here, among the newly freed. <sighs> the little Queen is right. Marine holds plenty of killers, and I know the worst. So what are we waiting for? Let's go get them. I don't know, Asher. They're not like us. To them, killing is a sport. It's mm. fun. Let them have fun with the White Hills, then. As long as they kill them, I don't care. Don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, that's not smart. That's not I'm smart. I'm further with the Queen. Don't get yourselves killed. Okay. Oh, okay. I have absolutely so, no option exactly of stopping him. Okay. Now, these fighters used to be slaves. If I had to guess, I'd say they'll be trying to live like masters. Hey, God Jester! <laughs> Making House Forester Regents of the North. Yes. Daenerys is not going to make it to Westeros. Let's just say that. Spoilers. You're freezing. Yeah, don't worry about it. Someone has to keep watch. Aw. Finn is so sweet. I freaking love Finn. Finn is like he's awesome. It's getting worse, isn't it? Yeah, sorry, buddy. I didn't pick up the bandages. We're only about a few days out from the Atla River. We cross a bridge the first men built. And from there, we can try to find the North Grove. Uh, right, Sylvie? We're not going north. We're going south to join Mance and the rest of the Free Folk. What? That was no, 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 always no. the plan, Cotter. I'm sorry, buddy. You can't stop me from going north. <laughs> I wouldn't try, but I'm not going with you either. And without me... Sylvie, he's come a long way. He knows what he's doing. Does he now? Tell me then, how did my brother get that gash in his arm? What does that have to do with the- Hush, what? I'm asking fish face here. Sylvie! Don't Sylvie me. I want to hear it from him. Some wildlings, a uh, free folk, uh, Mr. Cotter for a crow. Can't imagine why. We tried to reason with them and, well, well, things got out of hand. Out of hand? From the look of him, he was nearly killed? Yeah, well... Point is, you don't belong out here. Sylvie, I've known Garrett a while now. He may not be one of us, but I trust him. I've been waiting months for you, Cotter. And when you finally come home, it's with some crow who can barely build a fire. No, we don't need to die for him. Me neither. Fucking North Grove isn't even real. And if it is, it's probably full of wolves and more wildlings. It is real. Lord Forrester believed it. And so do I. And you're both idiots. Finn, will you just piss off? Hey. Some leader you turned out to be. Hey. Finn, baby. Hey, Finn. You should listen to him. <sighs> What is this? Every character like North doesn't people, like me this friggin' episode. Never come back. It's just not worth it. I shouldn't need Most to convince you. To travel, 
We head south. With or without you, Garrod. Sylvie. You need to rest. And we'll be wanting something to eat. I won't go far. Oh, don't be angry, Garrod. I'm not angry. This isn't what it looks like. I can explain. Why? Why'd you even bring me here, Cotter? You said you'd take me to the North Grove. Sylvie knows these woods better than I do. If anyone can find the North Grove, it's her. And besides, I couldn't just leave her. I won't do that. Not again. Hmm. Either she comes with us, or I'm out. So that's it. I can't head north without a guide. I go where she goes. I'm sorry, Garrett. Okay. All right. That's reasonable. I understand. I wouldn't leave without my sister either. Um. Okay. So. Where's Finn? Finn, baby, why are you angry? You wanted to escape with us. All of these people were like totally like up and willing to like escape Castle Black just last episode. What are you doing over here? There's a perfectly good fire. I'm not going anywhere near those fucking wildlings. Oh, come on. Uh -oh, come just on. give them a chance. I did. And look where it got us. True. I'm sorry True. for getting you into this mess. Really. Not your fault. I wanted to come. Just didn't know this is how it turned out. Come on, Finn. You'll freeze your ass off if you stay here. I suppose you're right. May as well get warm before I die. <sighs> You know what, Finn is being really real right now. I can definitely appreciate that. Family token. So, that's I their clan? wonder why she doesn't wear it. That looks like something ceremonial. Maybe she's royalty of some kind. I bet she has some sort of special ability. I mean, because she has white hair. That's... that's Uh oh, at least got infected with the poor Chris virus. <laughs> well, yeah, your joke didn't go so well, buddy. Oh, this is that stuff Cotter was drinking. Oh, well, it's not so bad. All right. Um, I don't. Think. Oh, I did. <laughs> wonder if she's ever seen an ice spider. Whew. Hope not. Okay. So, ice flies. <laughs> Chris. Um. Yo, she was over here. Sorry. Sorry. I like her though. I think she's a good character. Never met a crow before. Sorry, I almost killed you. You're fine. I've done you a favor though. Plenty <laughs> of things want to kill a crow up north. True. Oh, Giants, am I gonna go hunting with her? Yes. And ice spiders, and the White Walkers, of course. A spear sounds nice after all that, doesn't it? I'm not a crow anymore. I left that life behind me. Once a crow, always a crow. That's what they say, anyway. Don't frighten our dinner away. Shit. Here. I was never any good with a bow. Know how to use that? You're not going to shoot me in the leg, are you? I may do all right. 
Just be sure to keep it aimed that way. All right, here we go. No, no, no. God dang it. Is that what making do means? I'm sorry. <laughs> I waited too long. I thought I could anticipate it. All right, I got this. Oh, I have to hold it. <gasps> no! Oh, I'm no. joking. Maybe next time, Garrett. Well, no. since we don't have any food. No, no, let me try again! What's this? Your dinner. It won't fill you up, but it'll make you think you're not hungry for a while. At least I don't have to worry about you trying to shoot me. Dang it. <laughs> you ever lost anyone, Garrett? Someone you really cared about? Someone you thought you couldn't live without seeing ever again? Do you know yes. what that's like? I lost my family. First my mother, then my sister and father. So you know how it feels. Cotter and I. We lost everything, too. And we nearly lost each other. I didn't think he'd make it back this time. And I won't risk losing him again. Not even for the North Grove. You know something mm. about it, don't you? Only what I've heard. But don't get your hopes up. It's not worth it. So it is real, then? I didn't say that. It might be. A few years back, one of the Aish River clans set out to find it. They'd heard stories that the cold couldn't touch it, that it's safe even in the dark of winter. So they'd set out, all full of hope, and none of them ever returned. Yeah, because they stayed there and partied. <laughs> Maybe they stayed. Maybe they stayed there. Maybe they liked it. <laughs> Free folk never stay anywhere. You'd know that if you were. Help! Whoa. 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 Um. Look out! No. No. <gasps> no way. Oh my gosh. Am I gonna fight that thing? Oh my gosh. This looks like the place. <laughs> this is I swear to God, goodness. if Finn dies, I'm gonna So, who are flip. we dealing with exactly? Pit fighters. Two go in, one comes out. Day after day. No rules. Rapid attack. <laughs> Anyone who can survive that is capable of anything. <laughs> They're crazed savages. But one okay. pit fighter is worth any ten cell swords. Okay, sorry, Gab. I found that really funny. For you. And that's not going to be easy. Don't expect to charm <laughs> them or reason with them. If we're very lucky, we'll walk out with our heads. You were a pit fighter. If they're anything like you, we'll be just fine. Understand, they are nothing like me. These aren't soldiers. They're animals you <laughs> I really don't think we should recruit these guys. You know, I'd look somewhere else. Must make you feel pretty good, seeing the masters overthrown. They're not gone. They're just on their knees. And when they get back to their feet, they'll be more dangerous than ever. Well, then what would you rather have had happened? You did what? <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Trust me, you don't want to get involved, Russia. Okay. God, that is...
Your friends have been busy. Let's hope our heads don't end up here. All right, guys, let's do this. Oh, uh, one last thing. They're not fond of strangers. Okay. Or anyone who shows weakness. Or fear. Or really any highborn pricks with lily white asses like you, little brother. I can handle this. Oh, after you then. Well, she said that I shouldn't show fear, so. Well, if it isn't Beska, the fucking basilisk. We just want to talk to Amaya. You don't want to be in here, little man. You best go back the way you came before I decide to eat you. Not leaving. I'll start with your eyeballs. Fucking juicy when they pop. You sure you have room for me? You seem pretty well fed already. <laughs> My master only ever fed me when I won. I won a lot. Now, oh, sure. you got to the count of three to turn around and walk. Away. I'm not One, leaving. Two. No, I'm an idiot. I Out of my am way, an idiot. Or well, your next meal is my sword. I should have asked him to join us. <laughs> I like this one. Oh, okay. How does he even walk with that pair between his legs? <laughs> I, I have a big pair, guys. Look at that. <laughs> hey, whoa, 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 whoa! What? What was that guy standing there doing? What? <laughs> you know, that's not the first time someone told me I had a big pair. <laughs> Alright, guys. <laughs> oh. Well, okay. I guess we're going this way. I'll follow Beska. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Why can't I move? Well, I mean, that's one way. Well, hello there. Amaya! Take her! What? You must want something pretty bad to risk coming in here. Yep. So, out with it. Before I decide not to let you leave. Mm. I've come with an offer. One that'll interest you and your men. If you wanted my interest, you wouldn't have shown up with her. Hmm. <laughs> Well, too bad. I did. Amaya, please! Please what? I had a friend once, the Basilisk, but she died a long time ago. I earned my freedom! You walked out on me. On all of us. Fighting side by side, we were goddesses of the pits. But when you're born trash, I guess you can't help going back to the gutter. You have a problem with her? Deal with me. Oh, that's not what I meant. So, but okay. what is it that you want? Why shouldn't we rip you to pieces and feed you to the beast? <laughs> Maybe you should. My patience wears thin. My enemies mean to butcher my family in Westeros. They killed my father. No, God. They killed my little brother. And now I need great warriors to help me avenge their deaths and reclaim my home. All right. You think we sell swords? No. We don't fight other people's wars. We are pit fighters. Artists who paint in blood. That was yesterday. The fighting pits have been closed. You're all free now. Free to do what you want. Don't you see that? Yes, we are free. 
Why would we follow another? We don't have sure. masters anymore! Why would we follow anyone ever again? You all excel at combat, but you know nothing until you've tasted the thrill of war. Waves of men crashing together. Blood and steel. In Westeros, they sing of our great warriors for thousands of years. Amaya, trust me. He's got enough gold for all of you. If you want to lead pit fighters, you have to earn their respect first. We don't know who you are until okay. we see you bleed. All right. You're gonna Let's have to go. show them you can fight. All right. Who? You? Amaya. <laughs> His Let's name go. is Blood Song. He's vicious, fearless, and fast. Oh. Easy. Oh, I've never seen him before. Take a good look there. Eh, I thought worse. And what do they call that? That scary one with the two axes and the skull tattoo back in lease. What was it? Pestilence? Plague? The scourge. <laughs> right. The scourge. Anyway, he's dead. Well, <laughs> suppose I better get this over with. So what are you supposed to be? With your little axe and your pretty blonde beard. Mm -hmm. I'd sooner bend you over to fuck than fight you. <laughs> Thanks for noticing the beard. There you go. Well, come on! Let's see how you die! If I die in there... Yeah? You have a dying wish? This ought to be good. Will you at least kill Bloodsong? No. I'll use your queen's gold to get as far away from here as possible. Hmm. That probably hey, wasn't the right one to I do. Need those. All we'll right. fight with the weapons we give you. Alright, it's gotta be on their terms. I understand. You all see this cockless Westerosi? He's come to order us to battle. Like our masters did. I kill no man because another orders me to. I kill a man because it pleases me. All right. Let me show you how we dance in Marine. That's lovely. You know why I kill a man? So he's dead and I'm alive. Let's get this over with. Choose a weapon and try not to die. Mm. Only one of you leaves the pit alive. May the best fighter win. The All right, guys. Take your bets. Here, use this. Let's go. Oh, man, I got to get on this. Let's go. There we go. All right. Let's try it. Would it help if I stood still? Maybe. Come on, pretty boy. Something you'd like to say? Here 
that, boy? We cannot let the crowd go wanting. I think I can, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should have waited. Hmm. Oh, I got you. I've got you now. I don't care if they're unimpressed. The masters who once held your chains decided who lived and who died. But as you can see, I'm not here to be your master. I chose you for a reason. You're true warriors. Warriors I admire and respect. You deserve better than this. You deserve more than to die for someone else's entertainment. Fight with me! No oh, shit. And it won't just be for sport. You'll fight for a higher purpose. To save innocence and murder the guilty. If you've got the balls to follow me, we will set sail at dawn. And to those too craven to join me, to hell with you! All right. I knew them. What are those things? Oh, God. over here! Over here! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh! <laughs> Oh. oh my god, she is freaking scary. Oh no! 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 Oh, 
What the? Fire. No, 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 Finn. Finn, oh, they're everywhere. We make for the North Grove. We need to stick together. No. <gasps> I am so upset right now. I hope you're right about this, Garrett. God dang it! You're familiar with my brother's chambers, aren't you? Certainly you've been here before. You looked rather confused when you came in, as if you didn't know where you were. No, Your Grace. No? I'm told you know these chambers as well as anyone. You're quite the curiosity, aren't you? You made it clear your loyalty was with Lady Marjorie, yet now you hardly serve her at all. Have I displeased you, Your Grace? I've heard things. I understand you've been quite busy. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? One can never tell with you northern girls. Assuming an honest person exists in King's Landing. It hasn't been easy, Your Grace, but I've done what I've needed to do. Haven't we all? I've done my best to keep an open mind about people like you. Yet, Lucan tells me you invited yourself to Tolan's coronation party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. I do what's necessary, Your Grace. Including using another girl to talk your way in, I'm told. You're not above using people to get what you want. Good. Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless, considering the consequences. I had to speak with Lord Andros, Your Grace. It was urgent. Lord Andros? I don't imagine he'd appreciate being approached by a person of your stature. You've been such a busy little handmaiden. I assume Lady Marjorie knew nothing of this. No, Your Grace. This wasn't the first time you've hidden the truth from her. You've no qualms about lying to her, have you? Tell me the truth. Your secret is safe with me. Only when I must, Your Grace. I think we both know it's more often than that. Perhaps I mistook your northern stubbornness for ignorance, but now I see there's more to you. You're a cunning girl, and perhaps you can help me. Your Grace? You're quite friendly with my brother Tyrion. I need you to speak with him before the trial begins. I want to know who he intends to call as a witness on his behalf. Consider it a favor to the Crown, for which we will all be grateful. And if I refuse, Your Grace? Refuse? <laughs> and be branded a traitor like my brother? I, I understand, Your Grace. You may prove to be a useful little bird to me, assuming you do as you're told. In return, I'll take care of your problem with Lord Andros. Thank you, Your Grace. I never like the man anyway, and I doubt anyone will miss him.
You think we hired this boat for nothing? No, I don't know. That was a rousing speech you gave, little brother. But who knows how much they heard. They say your homeland is fat and prosperous. An orchard ripe for plucking. We'll take what we want and kill anyone who stands in our way. There's no spoils without victory. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about that. Victory is all we know. I'll show them their beds. I'll be there in a moment. Glad you made it. What choice did I have? You denied me an honorable death. So I must find one in Westeros. Vasco wasn't exaggerating. Malcolm, you're here! And you found your soldiers. Anrath will be glad of your return. You came oh. through for them. Well, at least it's gonna go to bed now. I just figured I would stop by the stream. Not at all. Jin! Oh, the hey, what? Have you been here? Surprise, but if I can, I'm sorry. I'd like I've to been like. I'm, what an I'm like really like upset right now. <laughs> Living here has made a better um, man of you. Well, nothing. I'm really glad you stopped by, buddy. Perhaps the same will be true for me. Thank you, Uncle. I, I wouldn't be appreciate doing this you stopping by, you. Jin. You've guided me well. That you had fun at work. Son, Please sleep well. For all your differences, he would be proud. If if I'll you are to going to so know you sail come for back Coast like this week, with, uh, let me know which days you're off work. I think I think you already told me. My thoughts will be with you in the fight to come. Um, I'll have to I'll have to message you. <laughs> Asher, have a good night, Jen. Iron from ice. Iron from ice. Casting off! <sighs> Take this. It'll help loosen his tongue. But be careful. He's a tricky little bastard. Iron from ice. Out, <laughs> yeah. Nothing. I'll be listening to every word you say. Sorry, guys. I was really upset. Oh, I ask for brawn, they send me a handmaiden. Oh. Well, you're here. You might as well come in. Let me guess. Your family is in grave danger. And you've come seeking my help? Not that I'd be of much use to you. As you can see, I'm at a bit of a disadvantage. I brought you a gift. Wine. You know the way to my heart. And you didn't even have to hide it. Hmm. I'm also Doesn't gonna go to sleep. Poison? Oh, see you, Poisoned. Simon. Cersei would love nothing more <laughs> than to sleep save well. the trouble of a And child. I hope one day you marry Vid. You don't expect me to drink alone, do you? They never let anyone in to see me. And I've grown tired of talking to myself. I suppose I'll have just a little. Ah, true girl of the North. Hmm. <laughs> Some things are worth dying for. Until what time are you streaming? Until Sir, this episode is done. Why are you here? Which I think it is. Almost. It's rather unusual for a handmaiden to visit the Black Cells. Cersei. <clears throat> he noticed that. All right, good. I have to admit, I've always admired your honesty, but I suspect there's more to you than one might imagine. <laughs> this is all a ruse, isn't it? Sorry? You're coming here. Yes, it is. We both know you have an ulterior motive. Yeah. Or so Cersei thinks. You've come to set me free. It's the perfect plan. No one would suspect it of you. Mm, I'm afraid not, unfortunately. Unfortunate for us both. 
You'll get set free by someone else. Not so, me. So, tell me. Cersei sent you, didn't she? You're marrying me off, Philly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but... <laughs> I know I'm not wrong. No, I'm not. She left me no choice. She never does. At least you had the courage to tell me the truth. Of course. I told you not to run your mouth. Stupid girl. You're acting a fool. Let me handle this. We're not done talking. You heard the girl. Go. Imp. <laughs> what did what my a sister child. expect you would learn? Who will testify on your behalf? She's using you. And will continue to do so. Until you no longer prove useful. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh, clearly. Which is why you're here. Doing mm -hmm. her bidding. No. And I'm what not. would Lady Marjorie make of your new friendship with my sister? I doubt she'd be pleased. Assuming she doesn't dismiss you immediately. Lady Marjorie will understand. Cersei left me no choice. Let's hope she understands. Because absent her protection, you're in a very precarious position. <clears throat> what should I tell Cersei? She knows the answer better than anyone. No one will testify for me. Yeah. She's already seen to that. That is the truth of it. Not that it will help you. I appreciate your honesty, Lord Tyrion. And I yours, Lady Mira. Mm. Though I doubt my sister will. Enough of this nonsense! You're wasting my time! Out! Now! I wish you well, Lady Mira. Be careful you. who you trust. Yeah, I'm not trusting Cersei, so. Is Vid a girl? <laughs> no. Vid is not a girl. Would it make a difference? Ooh. Asking the tough questions. Yikes, his back. Must you leave? Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. You didn't sleep, did you? Yikes. Neither did you. We haven't slept much at all these last few weeks. I... I hope you don't have any regrets. About this. About us. I've never felt more certain about anything. I'm glad. I wasn't sure of you. With all that's happened. What will we do now? Now that we're... Uh, what we are. We'll be married. And no one will be able to keep us apart. Not Griff. Not his father. Not Ramsay Snow. I was hoping you'd say that. Roderick? Of course. Oh! I'm sorry! Talia! <laughs> I thought you were alone. Good morning, Talia. Hello, Elena. Oh, I, I didn't realize you two were... I mean, I didn't realize she was... It's okay. It's okay, right, Talia. It's okay, Talia. I really am sorry. It's just, this is urgent, Roderick. And... It's, it's all right. I can go. You two Aww. need to speak. Poor Elena. I'll see you soon, I hope. Bye-bye, Elena. <laughs> Poor thing, she doesn't ever close with her. Aw. All right then, I'm listening. Nudity, yeah. Last night, oh my I god. <laughs> I was having nightmares, so I. Go on, Talia. I went back there. Where? To the grove. And someone was there. What do you what? mean? Look. This is a report. How many fighting men we have? Where Griff and the White Hill Garrison are being held? Um... He even talks about Elena. I know. It's everything. I couldn't believe it. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... You said you saw someone. Who? 
Someone we trusted. Talia, I need to know who it was. He's like family, Roderick. Duncan. But it doesn't matter. He's a traitor. He endangered our house. You have to deal with him like you would any other man. I'm sure he had his reasons. But no reason is good enough. It's your duty to tell me. And mine to pass judgment. I'm thinking Just it's promise Duncan. Me you'll kill him, Roderick. Anyone I've, I've always, like this from episode one, thought it was Duncan. I'm asking you, as your sister, make him pay. No, I'm not going to promise I'm till I know. This house, Talia. It's my job to deliver justice, not vengeance. I can't promise to kill a man before I've heard him out. You know what he's done. That should be enough. Talia, please. Come with me. He's in the Great Hall. Um... It, I bet you it's Duncan. It has to be Duncan. I'll never tell. God dang it, God Jester. <laughs> Lily called Duncan so hard. Yeah, from episode one. From episode one, I never liked Duncan. That's why Royland is my sentinel. Go get the guards. Yeah, why is he hiding? Oh. Oh. My lord. I knew <laughs> it! Oh, you piece of crap! I knew it! I never trusted you, you so piece know. of crap. I knew it, I knew I it, I knew it. Oh my god. But it's done now. You betrayed us, Duncan. After everything my family's done for you. What I did, I did for your own good. No, you did it without my permission. For House Forrester. For your father's legacy. We trusted you, Duncan. My father took you off a pig farm to make you his castellan. I've cared for his family like it's my own. Then why? Because you're reckless, Roderick. Just as Ethan was. Choosing that warmonger, Royland, as his sentinel. Ethan was a boy. But you're not. And you've been endangering this house since the day you got home. Oh, my God. defying Griff and leaving our Tengren oh. to pay the price. <laughs> oh, buddy. Royland. Oh man. When the day called for diplomacy. You are not the Lord, man. Getting Arthur killed. Enough, Duncan! You're not a leader. Oh. You're a wounded soldier trying to prove he's still a man. I'm not, I'm am actually I? actually trying to save this family. Are you? Everything I've done, I've done for them. And the North Grove. Did you tell them about that too? No. They've never even heard the name. I've kept the secrets that mattered. The only thing that matters is that you swore an oath to obey me. And you broke it. I swore to obey your father. He commanded respect. All you command is violence. What? This house is doomed with you in charge. When? When have I ever hit anybody? It hurts me to say that. And I wish you'd never crawled off that corpse cart. Oh... You're a traitor, Duncan. Nothing you say will change that. I know what I did was right. No, it wasn't. Duncan, how could you? My lord, Griff's gone. Someone helped him escape. Was this your doing? I swear. Lud was going to ambush you at the exchange. I did it to save your life. But Ryan, Duncan, I trusted you. You know what? You probably could have told us about the ambush. Instead of acting on your own accord. Let's just get this over with. What do you want me to do with him, my lord? You did- Oh my gosh. Oh my Kill gosh. Me, and I won't be able to help you save Asher. He's in danger, Roderick. <gasps> what do you mean? I know Lud's plans. Spare my life. And I'll tell you everything. Please, Roderick. Perhaps we should hear him out. He's only saying that to save himself. You have to decide, my lord. 
Whatever you decide, temper your anger with wisdom. If not for my sake, then for your families. Uh. I'll spare your life. Now talk. I'm sorry, Talia. I, um, girl, I get you. Mira no cost idea. Lord his army. He's desperate to strike back. He's going to ambush Asher the moment he makes landfall. No! Take this traitor away! Really? That's all the information you can give me? <laughs> Silencing that it? me won't change things. You're making a mistake! Oh my god. What Duncan said. We have to warn Asher. We can't, not if he's at sea. My lord, what do we do? Where is he gonna land? We'll be there. Prepare the horses. We're gonna we'll defend there. my brother. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> Smell that. We're almost there. Let's get. Let's have a look. Come on, break it up. Save your love making for below deck. They listen to you. <laughs> Barely. But what happens if your lord brother decides he's the one in charge once we're at Iron Rath? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Or will no. it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A lord sounds an awful lot like a master. I'm just another sword. No different than any of you. Roderick is the rightful lord. Trust me, everyone will love him. They'll want to fight for him. Hey, if he's anything like you, well, we'll see. <laughs> oh, is this it? Is this it? Is this going down right now? That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. Could be. Or could be we'll have a fight on our hands. I'll let the others know. Right. Oh, this couldn't be easy, could it? I probably should have said that they will answer to me, but... I don't, I don't know if they will. Are you ready for the next choice? So, this uh -oh. is Westeros. Ugly and small. Fucking freezing, too. I said you'd be paid. I never said you'd be warm. <laughs> Asha. Thank the gods you've made it back. Good to see you, my lord. Hope you're ready for a fight. What? I'm showing him respect in front of these lord soldiers. Lord knows you're coming. He sent men to intercept you. We need to hurry. Been stuck on a boat for weeks. Could use a good fight. Hey, get him! No! Get that gate open! All right, all right. Let's kill some people. Let's go. All right. <gasps> no, 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 no. Not him. Out of my way. Yeah, kill him. Yes. No. You have to get out of 
that. Looks like it's up to us. She's Asha. It's okay. It's all right. Come on. Just got to get to the gate. Raise the gate. They've got us outnumbered. Oh shit. Go. 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 We have to get out of here. No way, no. One of us has to stay. No. No. What? What? Are you, are you kidding me? Oh my god, are you serious? I know what I'm doing. Iron from ice, bro. Iron from ice. No! You bastard! Basically. You're fucking leaving me? What the fuck am I supposed to do? I came here for you! We're supposed to fight together, always! Together. Kill every last one of these fuckers. Start with him. <laughs> Rip their fucking hearts out.
sí. Telltale, because <laughs> I feel so awful right now. Just when you think Telltale hasn't screwed you over <laughs> enough. Hold on guys, <laughs> I need to, I need to like gather myself right now, hold on. to me. <sighs> I can cry about this later. <laughs> um, <laughs> wow. Um, just, just, wow. I can't even This is, this is true storytelling. Like this is, yeah. <laughs> like this is, this is like the best thing out there right now. Telltale again and again and again. Just, oh my God, they are, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> the series is so good. Um, I, I like, I like melted down. Like whenever I 
finished um, season one of Game, Game, not Game of Thrones, sorry, of Walking Dead, they are just, they are on point with everything, with, I can't, I just, ugh. <laughs> I know this is really weird to be like crying in pain, like because, because uh, of that ending. But at the same time, like I'm so happy that like I feel like this. <laughs> like, it's not like it's not, it's not sane. <laughs> it's like not normal. <laughs> but like, I'm really upset right now. <laughs> but I'm so happy that I'm upset. Oh my god. <sighs> um uh yeah, so that was that was my um <clears throat> that was my playthrough of episode five. Um I'm sorry that I like I I kinda broke down there at the end that no I didn't mean to do that. That wasn't my intention. Uh I <laughs> actually I'm kind of embarrassed right now. I'm sorry. Um, 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 I'm going to I'm gonna end the stream and like <laughs> cry out the rest of this pain and then I'm gonna go to sleep. So um, I hope to see you guys uh, Saturday. <sighs> I'll be I'll be doing um Wolf Among Us. <sighs> okay, alright. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright, have a good night guys. <laughs> <laughs>